Well, God bless you, beloved. This is your girl, Sharon, once again, from my front seat. And here we are giving God all praise, honor, and glory for what you say, beloved, for this brand new day. Well, today, brand new day. Well, today is Monday. Today is June 26, 20 and 23. And here we are giving God all praise, honor, and glory for what you say, beloved, for this brand new day. Why? It did not have to be this way. So today we're rocking our Carnival Cruise Line Groove for St. Jude t-shirt. T-shirt and sweats on a Monday. Mm, it was that kind of feeling this morning. We are here. We're in the workplace by the grace of God. So on yesterday, we served our Father's Day breakfast. And I know Father's Day was a week ago. Um... But about 15 years ago, we started serving steak and baked potato, salad, dinner roll type breakfast on Father's Day. Um, we could not actually serve on Father's Day uh, because there was some construction work being done um, where we rent um, the church and so we had to postpone the breakfast we did have breakfast still because God has blessed us for maybe 18 years now to serve breakfast every Sunday and by the grace of God every week he has provided he is Jehovah Jireh our provider um, so we had to but God knew what he was doing right so yesterday uh, we served the steak and baked potato so yours truly went to El Super. You know, that store is pretty good. And um, I purchased 50 steaks by the grace of God. And they were the seven bone in chuck steak, I believe it said. And when I tell you each piece was nice and big, um, we purchase 50 we had 50 potatoes beloved when I tell you the people kept coming the people kept coming and I'm going to say the first 45 people had their own steak after like 45 then we did have to you know cut the steaks in half uh, maneuver around that bone beloved but when I tell you to the last person well I'm gonna say second to the last got a plate then there was this man he walked up and he was like right across the street the entire anyway stay focused share and focus God blessed and I'm reminded I was reminded this morning as I was well, even we mentioned it yesterday um, the two fish and the five loaves of bread the masses were there and Jesus being a man of compassion he said the people have been with me a very long time was it like three days or something like that? they've been with me a while and if I send them on their way now they will faint on the way uh, we need to feed the people disciples are like feed the people what from where and Jesus says well survey the crowd you know hey we gonna do what we do and there's a little lad, a little boy, and he has his lunch. Beloved, the word of God says that Jesus took it, he blessed it, break it, feed the people. The people were served. Um, and then when all was said and done, there were baskets left. Now, I think one account, there were like uh, 5,000, not counting women and children, and then there was another 4,000. But each time, beloved, the point is there were baskets left over. Now, we didn't have no steak and no potato left over, but we did have some salad left over. Beloved, I'm so grateful to God because God always provides. And we were kind of texting last night, and it was like the people kept coming and the steak kept multiplying. Beloved, when I tell you the people continue to come and God continued to multiply the stake and there were so many new faces and God blessed. And I'm grateful that 
all of our regular because there are those who hear about it word gets out and then many come but those who God has called us to serve and that we've been serving faithfully by the grace of God uh, week after week month after month year after year um, they all received a stake except for one lady because she can oh give it to them give it to them give it to them give it to them until it was like honey you gonna get half a stake um but everyone received their own stake and it was such a blessing so i give god the glory for your prayers i give god the glory um for your contribution i'm just so thankful to god uh, for what God did. Amen. So I'm going to eat my breakfast of champions, my senior cup of coffee. They take like 50 cent off a jack in the box with a senior cup and my two tacos. Hey, um, you know, I'm about to say, let me grab my breakfast in about half an hour. I'm going to get inside and I'm going to render unto Caesar those things which belong unto Caesar. And if it be the Lord's will, We'll meet again on when, on tomorrow, from where, from my front seat. This your girl Sharon. She tired, but I'm out, y'all. Deuces.